Question 63. An algorithm takes a list of numbers and it goes pair by pair and it chooses the maximum numbers so it returns a, basically a list that's half as long as the list that it started out with. For example, let's just call this prepare, compare max by pairs. If it has the uh, sequence 3, 7, 6, 8, 2, 1, 4, 5, it's going to reduce that down to 7, 8, 2, and 5 where it takes the pairwise maximum of each of these things and reduces it to this new uh, list. And then, of course, it will reduce that further. This one will be 8, 5, and then it will finally reduce down to 8. So, <clears throat> what the question asks is, suppose that the elements of the initial list is 1 through 64 in random order. So we have the numbers 1 through 64 in random order in a list. What's the probability that the number 63 will appear in the final two element list? That's basically the probability that 63 will last all the way to the end. Well, what is that probability? First of all, we have um, some some sequence here and we have 64 and then we have some other sequence. We need the probability that 63 is not next to 64. What's the probability that 63 is not next to 64? Well, wherever 63 is, or sorry, wherever 64 is, 63 can't be right next to it, so the uh, probability is basically 62 out of 63. So basically there's there's 62 sorry there's 63 spots in this array that are not where 64 is. There's one spot that's next to 64 because it's pairwise it'll be either in front or behind it but it doesn't really matter. There's only going to be one place in this 63 numbers that is not uh, that is next to 64. So there's 62 places that are not next to 64. So the chance of 63 not being next to 64 is 62 out of 63. 62 chances out of 63. Now when the thing reduces to the next level, there's going to be 32 we start off with 64, and now it's going to be reduced down to 32 places. Well, 64 is going to be in one of those places. The other 31 places could be, 63 might still be in there. Well, we don't want to be next to 64, so there's going to be 30 out of 31 chances that it's not next to 64. I hope you're following me on this. Then it's going to split in half again. How many chances are there? I mean, 64 is obviously going to be in the list because 64 is the highest number. What are the chances where 63 is not next to 64? Well, there's 15 places for 63 to be. 14 of them are not next to 64. So again, it's 14 out of 15. The same happens when it reduces down to 8. There's going to be 6 out of 7 spots it could possibly be. When it reduces down to 4, then there's going to be 2 out of 3 spots that it could possibly be. And the asks, this asks here, what's the probability that the number 63 will appear in the final two element list? So this, this is the is the number here. 62 divided by 63 times 30 divided by 31 times 14 divided by 15 times 6 divided by 7 times 2 divided by 3. Now, as you can imagine, this reduces. 31 will divide into 62 and this becomes a 2. 15 divides into 30, this becomes a 2. 
7 divides into 14, this becomes a 2. 3 divides into, into 6, and this becomes a 2. So we have now 2 to the 5th over 63, which is 32 over 63. And that, my friends, is answer C.